All right, hey there everybody, how you doing? This is George, AKA Agent 86. Today I got a client on the line and I'm gonna be showing him how to install TeamViewer Quick Support on his Asset S912. Great, we're live. All right, buddy. Okay, great. So uh -huh. you see on the screen here, you, uh, you see over here, I got my home, apps, music, games, all of that stuff. The same thing that you're yeah. seeing on your side, right? Yeah. Okay, great. So what I'm gonna want you to do, first thing, is to go down to your apps so you see where I went down to apps there right yeah and what we're gonna be doing is going into the Google Play Store and that's this icon right here that I'm shaking the mouse on Do you see that one there on your uh, on your box right here on the Google Play Store brothers right there on the apps Google Play yep. Store All right. I'm gonna go to Google I do okay All right. So you should see right there where it says checking info also, right? Hang on. Checking info just popped up and okay. it's, it's moving. Okay. All right. That's so, telling me to sign in. Yeah, it's telling mind. you to sign in. So I'm going to help you with the sign in because you've already told me you don't have a Gmail. So I have a generic email that I'm going to uh, that I'm going to give you. In here, right. I want you to type get smart media client all right just let me know when you got that part so for those watching live is anybody watching for those watching live uh, we will sh make a shorter version of the video later brother you gotta work with me here I am right I'm here. trying to work with you right here it, it, so you got it in there finally yeah yeah so I go to the green the arrow or what do I go where do I go to get out of here? yeah you you should be able to click the green arrow and then it's gonna take us to the next screen so uh, right here now it's gonna ask for a password oh Jesus don't make it come on man do you trust me because I don't want the whole world knowing my uh, my password there <laughs> listen for those of you watching the video at this point you're going you're logging in with your own email so put your own password in there uh, for those of you doing uh, doing this at home it's gonna say welcome and then whatever your <laughs> gmail account is it's going to say by signing in you agree to the terms of service and the privacy policy we're going to click I agree right uh, it's going to uh, say you know Google services to learn blah 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 who cares just click agree the show must go on and uh, basically we're gonna we're just gonna keep on going with the video and show you exactly uh, what you need to go ahead and get TeamViewer Quick Support up and running on your unit. So, uh, once you've gone through, you've put your password uh, in the Google Play Store, you should be able to, to come right into here to the Google Play Store. And uh, up here at the very top, you have this search bar. So, we're going to want you to click that search bar and type in Quick Support. Right? And you'll see this little icon here, Team Viewer Quick Support. We'll click right there, and there it is. We install. So a lot of people they install Team Viewer and they think it's just going to work like that. But uh, what a lot of people don't know is that there's an add-on that you need for the remote control part to actually work on your Android unit. So normally, if you were to put it on another device, when you open Team Viewer you'll be faced with uh, it, it'll give you a little pop-up that tells you hey there's a there's an add-on uh, however when you put it on these Android boxes it, it just doesn't pop up however however you can also download team viewer host so you see here we have team viewer host down here if you don't see that down there you could always just search it up in the top team viewer host right we're gonna install team viewer host this is the trick right here so a lot of people should really be happy about this trick right here you install team viewer host right here's where the magic comes in you click open and there's our pop-up this device supports our remote control feature we're gonna click install maybe you can't see that because I'm here let me get rid of myself here boom so just click right here where it says install right it's gonna ask us do we want to install this down in the bottom right corner click install 
there we go now just click done all right so let's back out all the way back out all the way go back to the home screen all the way to the home screen now if you want to save some internal memory you could always go ahead and just uninstall team viewer host later on because you don't need it the only reason we install it in the first place is just so that we could get that add-on and uh in that way the team viewer quick support is going to actually work so i have team viewer uh set up here on my computer i'm going to go ahead and give you this window here i'm going to show you from both from both sides all right so what you're looking at here is my control window for team viewer if, if you're a user, you're not going to see this side. This is for the people, the technicians. This is what you see, right? So for the client, what you're going to need to do is first go to quick support. You're going to see this screen right here, and uh, you're just going to slide to the right, slide to the right, right? And there you go. So next your ID All right so right up here not send my ID people always say send my no not send my ID your ID in this case it's 604-757-959 on your device it's going to be different right so if you are the technician what you're going to do is in that screen you're going to type in the uh the id 604-757-959 and uh then i'm going to click on connect to partner the other side the client is going to see this screen right here it says would you like to allow you know whatever the name of the computer is in my case is get smart media to remote support my android device and, and i want you to press allow once you press allow, there we go. We now have access. Uh, now you're going to just kind of give it uh, a couple seconds. And there we go. Now I can remote control the box. If you're the uh, the technician, this is what you're going to see. You know, that's my box, and then this is my computer here where I'm controlling the box. So if I click here uh, on the Avenger Store, right? then on the box it opens the Avenger store All right so right here where it says uh, allow or deny if I was to you know if I'm the technician right and I click allow here it's gonna click allow right there for the client so it's pretty simple that's that's pretty much that's pretty much it on how to install and uh, and use it. So that that pretty much does it for how to install Team Viewer Quick Support. Sorry guys that this video ran a little uh, a little late. My client was having a little bit of trouble. And one thing about it, we definitely got the best service out there. No one else is going to spend an hour uh, on the line with their clients the way that we survive always is by word of mouth you know and by doing good things not just having good quality products but giving the people good quality support uh, including being able to remote assist the units not only that but you know we also offer a lot of our services absolutely free here on YouTube for you guys and it takes a lot of time uh, to make these videos and edit these videos but uh, when everything's said and, and done it I feel that it's worth it you know if the money's not there uh, you know we get a feeling here every time we successfully help one of our clients and uh, well that's pretty much it so uh, we're gonna go ahead and end this video here uh, on how to install team viewer quick support on your Android device It's gonna work on pretty much any Android device minus the uh, you know little crappy where is it here this little Amazon piece of crap here you know it's not gonna work on this this is trash this is this is it's, 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 it's trash oh, hold on wait a minute it didn't hit the floor try again 
That, that's, what, that's what we think of the Amazon Fire Stick around here. You know, that thing is trash. You know, we don't sell trash. What do we sell here? We sell good quality products. Here we go. Boom, the asset. S912. Check it out on Amazon. All you got to do is search the words asset S912. Check out the specs. Let me know what you think. And uh, don't forget to drop your comments down there in the uh, in the bottom there. If you have any more questions, definitely don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. We definitely appreciate you watching. And, uh, and as always, well, have a great day. Let's look at some other stuff. While you're doing that, let's look at some other stuff. What else do we got here to play with? This here, this old top secret right here. Y'all don't know what this is. This is the new game controller right here. Oh, I'm not supposed to be showing that. Oh, spoiler alert. Uh-oh. Oh, by the way, for anybody watching, one of the largest distributors of the Logitech K400 Plus. We also have the Link remote control from Azul, which is an awesome little remote control, full keyboard on the back, gyroscopic, so I can move the thing around, and that's how I move my mouse. It's also infrared, so I can use this to uh, control my television as well. Listen, if you need a new computer, check this out. This is the Byte 3, right? So, look at that, man. This is a nice, nice little computer right here. You can check it out on my buddy's website, Azul website. Piece of hardware right there. All right, so we're not being sponsored by Marlboro. Actually, no one's sponsoring us. But I got these things in the in the mail the other day. If anybody smokes Marlboros and they want these $2 off coupons here, just let me know. I'll throw it in the mail for you. Just looking at You don't smoke Marlboros, do you? But all is off, man. I know those things are expensive. By the way, Marlboro, if you're watching this and you want to sponsor me. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs>